Hello, my name is Ten. I'm nine years old, and I want to be a doctor in the future. Hello, my name is Nook. I'm ten years old. I want to be a teacher. These children are from Isan in northeast Thailand. Here, seventy percent of the population is classified as poor. Because of this, many Isan people seek higher-paying work outside the region, leaving their children behind, with no hope of achieving their dreams. There are no opportunities for the kids to build a future here. So, at the age of 15, 16, they get on the bus to a big city, Bangkok, somewhere else, to be employed as cheap paid workers in building constructions, as maids in rich households, or even worse, in the sex industry. By providing the children here in the schools with the necessary tools, with the necessary infrastructure, they can obtain a decent education. And that's the starting point of further development. Ronnie Voutiens works for Deloitte, and providing the children with the necessary infrastructure is exactly what his organization has done. One of the largest professional services organizations in the world, Deloitte collaborates with Close the Gap to actively help bridge what is often referred to as the digital divide. Whilst we've done terrific things country by country around the world, we can make a bigger contribution if we do more together, so we collaborate more within our organisation around the world. And a great example is the Close the Gap initiative. Uh, a number of our countries uh, have combined to support this terrific initiative, which is proving to be extremely valuable in Thailand. Close the Gap is recovering computers that are changed by corporates throughout industrialized uh, countries. It's making them up to date, reconditioning them, putting new legal software on them, and then making them available to budget-limited organizations in developing countries. Olivier van den Eyende, also an employee of Deloitte Belgium, is the founder of Close the Gap. He started the NGO in 2003, while still at university in Brussels. Close the Gap works on the principle that IT equipment becomes outdated in the West very rapidly. So they create value for another group of users who cannot otherwise afford to use computers. To date, Close the Gap has shipped 30,000 computers to schools and organizations across the developing world. They reach almost 300,000 learners on a daily basis. The NGO is run like a business. Professionals are employed to repair the used computers and make sure logistics are running smoothly. Those who receive the computers pay a nominal fee to cover these costs. Sometimes donors are found to cover costs so poor communities get everything for free. This is where companies like Deloitte come in. They have great ideas, and if these ideas are resourced and invested in, we can really make a difference. It's just the right thing to do. It's the right thing for all businesses to play their part in the overall corporate responsibility agenda. In addition to the hardware, the Close the Gap computers are equipped with software from eLearning for Kids. eLearning for Kids is a software application that offers courses in math, science, reading, keyboarding, the English language and health and life skills. The partnership with Close the Gap is only one example of Deloitte's community investment work. A partnership that has given children across the world opportunities that they would not otherwise have. My name is Boombin. I am 12 years old and I want to become a policewoman in the future. Boombin's mother works in a factory. Her father is a driver. Her parents left their village and their child to find work. Now her aunt looks after her full time. Bumbin was a bright student even before the computers arrived, but she was not getting the individual attention she needed from her teachers. What Close the Gap and eLearning for Kids have done has given her the opportunity to learn at her own much faster pace. So the challenge is in, in a classroom where you have 25 or more children, they all have a different level. And as a teacher, you can only spend so much time um, to help an individual child to take him or her skills to the next level. With the e-learning programs, it's very interactive. 
In 2007, Deloitte started working with the Bantanong School in Isan, Bumbin School. They provided 24 computers and a local network. In August 2007, an installation team from Deloitte, Belgium, travelled to Bantanong to install the equipment. At the Bantanong School, there are currently 550 students who come from 12 neighbouring villages. The school also opens its doors and its computers to former pupils, as well as the community. If I become a policewoman, I will work hard to earn money and build a big house and take care of my parents. With projects like this one, the dreams of children like Bumbins can become a reality.